Hey, what's happening everyone? Vegetarian Zombie here. Welcome back to Fallout 76. When we last left off, we were at the Wayward, just kind of hanging out. And as you can see, there are a bunch of idiots here. <laughs> That's what I like to call my fellow players. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to head back to my base and we're going to see what happens because we've activated our sign and our honeypot is up and ready. Okay, so this is kind of a weird viewpoint. There we go. Let's break out our gun here. We are good to go. Nice. All right, so here we are. What is this? Is there bodies? Bodies outside my house? <laughs> what is this? This is my happy house. Why are there super mutants? Is this my house? This is my house. All right. Let's see what happens. Hello? Anyone there? What's this over here? Interesting. We have a person. Shall we say an NPC? A nymphs? <laughs> That's how you say it. What's up, dude? Whoa. You're not Crane. What the hell's going on here? Oh. Uh, you know Crane? Uh, let me see. You know Crane? He'll tell you anything where he's sort of blah, blah, blah. Move along, little man. <laughs> I'm waiting for someone, and you don't yeah, you don't want to be around when they arrive. Tell me your, what's your gang, or I'll eat your eyeballs. All right, let's move on. Like hell. I haven't seen Crane for weeks, and now you're using his identity to what? Lure in Marks? Where is he? Where is he? Um, your guess is as good as mine. Uh, let me see. No, we're not going to mention the bar. That's none of your concern. Now get out of here. Fine. I find Crane myself. Thanks for nothing, prick. You call me a prick? Hey, dude, dude, let's talk for a second. Guess I'll just find Crane myself. Boom! <laughs> oh wow, he took it right in the head. What a champ! <laughs> You're not finding nothing. All right, let's see if uh, anyone else shows up. <laughs> This is a nice, friendly house I have. I have dead bodies of super mutants outside. Uh-oh, who's this? Who's this? Look at this, we got we got problems. These guys are radical. They're free radical. What up, dude? What up, man, you wanna talk? Putting your name on a sign? What the hell were you thinking, Crane? You call me Crane? We ain't here to chat. Spill or shut up. Let's chat. What the hell are you looking at? That treasure. Sooner or later. Let's see this guy. Why not Let's chat make with this him. Easy? Yo, what's up? You crane? Mm. Quite the setup you look got. At the, look here. at this guy. It's like a so, like a 50s greaser. Rumor is you've got information our boss wants. You tell me where this treasure is, and he's willing to leave you alone. Scout's honor. Oh, Scout's honor then. Hey, I, I since he's since he's doing that, you know, I mean, he's obviously legit. Yeah, let's give him. A, let's do us. Let's do in intimidation. You tell me where your hideout is, or I'll turn you inside out. Even though I'm kind of smaller. You than what? Uh, uh, sure. Fine, fine. We we took over the old West Virginia Lumber Company in the Northwest. Come on, let's get out of here. All right, I'll kill you later, man. Huzzah! All right, and he gave me a couple steaks and some water. <laughs> Get out of here! Nice. So I guess we can head back over back to the uh, bar, tell the Duchess what happened, and yeah, get some more reward. And I'm sure that's going to be the end of the quest. <laughs> All right, so much for my little crap house. I think what I want to do is move my base somewhere off this beaten path, somewhere somewhere that's not so well trodden, shall we say, and that doesn't bring in a lot of people. That way, when I load up in a, ro a world, I won't have those, like, conflicts. Okay, let's just check out this place. This is the... What does that say? Slow comes Joe. <laughs> sounds. This sounds very healthy. It's just uh, I don't know what the blocks are for. 
Also, one thing I did notice is that I am low on food stu food supplies. So I'm going to need to pick some stuff up. And I'm also getting lots of spoiled vegetables. So I'm guessing all the picking I'm doing is uh, just rotting away. So I, I, I'm guessing what I'll need to do... What I'm guessing I'm going to need to do is ultimately craft those those items right away. I always hate it when the... the like, come on, man. Turn off the radio. All right. Before we do anything, let's scrap our items. Let's scrap all the junk. Yes! Awesome. I will say the one thing I love about Fallout 76 is... What is going on here? <laughs> Uh, I am a little perturbed. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to take your stuff and I'm going to leave. Thank you. Thank you for the donation. Ooh, more bobby pins. Can never have enough of those. And we got all that stuff. I mean, one thing I really love about Fallout 76 is the photo mode. Like, it's just a lot of fun to uh, set, up, set up pictures, take funny photos. And what's awesome about the photo mode is that it's used during the loading screens so as you if you go through and go through every major landmark you'll see the your your trip your like photos as the game loads and i love that i absolutely love it generally i don't like photo modes i think they're kind of uh kind of lame but i've really enjoyed it in fallout 76. okay we're back at the wayward let's uh go what is this workbenches this way <laughs> You know, that's always like a trap, you know, like, I don't trust those things. Who's this? Duchess is damn lucky you showed up when you did. Are you talking Hope to me? You a drink or two. Wait, who are you? Anything you need's inside. All right, here we go. Hey, Duchess and whatever that guy's name is. Well, you don't look too worse for wear. You managed to figure out where those miscreants are hiding. Oh, yeah, I sure did. Sounds like they're headquartered at West Virginia Lumber Company. Fantastic. So that's where their boss will be. Mm-hmm. You just need to... Wait, what? Wait, wait, wait. West Virginia Lumber? <laughs> that is not right. You shut you up. I'm not talking to you. Sure. And that's of concern. Why exactly? was wandering up that way not too far back. The lumber company? That place was overrun with a bunch of those big green bastards. Mutants. Oh, great. You've seen those Frankensteins. If this gang was able to clean those things out of the mill, Duchess, these guys might be tougher than advertised. Oh, hmm. they're advertising now. You got any recommendations on how you'd proceed? Well, I wouldn't go in guns blazing, unless... You got some big guns. I, I don't. Try and luck your way inside. Maybe see if they want to talk to you. But there was this family I ran into up that way that I'm sure has had to deal with them already. There was also this, uh, let's say, uh. special scrapper who was making some pretty bold claims about his knowledge of the mill. Okay. Maybe a bad idea to check in with either of them. Oh, why don't you do all this stuff? All right, uh, tell me about this family. You'll find them at Anchor Farm if you these thugs haven't already run them off. But They're... if they are still there, well, they probably managed to work something out with them. Hey, it couldn't hurt to find out what it was. I love how you, you, you're both assuming that I'm going to do this. <laughs> Found them living in the stalls at Tyler County Fairground of all places. This guy kept claiming he could wipe out everything at the mill by himself. Oh, okay. And I said, mm -mm, no way. The fairground's pretty rough. I couldn't get him rough. to spill how. Probably a better chance he'll share what he learned with someone who still has an entire face. Because look at me. You know this guy... You haven't already explored up that way. He sounds the like he's falling asleep. The drop back would be via Vault 76 and trekking north from there. And take care of yourself, all right? You're doing us a big one here. Why don't you do it? Uh, okay, is that the end of the conversation? I'd be careful trying to talk to their leader. I presume he's even nastier than the pieces of work that have been bothering us. I didn't agree to this. I don't care how you do it. <laughs> just get him out of my hair. <laughs> when you find him, just make it crystal clear they're not to bother us again. You know, I'm just going to steal your cup, your cigarettes, and your ashtray. What do you think about that? That's my payment. 
<laughs> and what else? Whatever. What else you have here? Another dirty ashtray. That's mine. I'm gonna take another pack of cigarettes. Your favorite clipboard. Yeah. So so take that. Uh, okay. Okay. Fine. We'll go off on a mission. I was just coming through to say hello, but no. All right. So we have some interesting things ahead. Uh, the first thing, what are the, what is this? Citizens. Nuclear strike imminent. Oh, jeez. Death from above. All right. Uh, let's check this out. Let's. Thank you for your cooperation. All right. Let's check this out. Let's see what we got here. Uh, where's the strike? Chances are, like, this is a pretty safe zone. Once you get out of that zone... Okay, it's right here. The blast zone. Huzzah. Uh, maybe one day we'll see a nuclear strike, and maybe even another day we'll launch one. But for now, we're going to head over to this farm. Now, as far as the optional things are concerned, uh, the, the county fairgrounds, that's kind of a rough place. And I don't remember Anchor Farm, so we're going to go to both of them. So let's open up the map one more time. That is not the map. <laughs> Unless it's tattooed on my butt. Okay, so what we'll do first is head up to Vault 76. Then we'll head up to the farm over here. And ultimately, we'll make our way to the fairground, which is going to be nasty. And then finally, after the fairground, we'll head up to the lumber, the lumber company. So, like, once we reach this area, it's going to be very heavy, like, a lot of gunfire. And uh, I don't really have a lot of weapons, so we'll see how this turns out. Oh, there goes the nuke. <laughs> I, I think it's kind of cool hearing the nukes go off every once in a while. There's only been one case where I was actually in the blast zone, and but I managed to get out in time. Honestly, if I got nuked, I think it would be hilarious. <laughs> like, it's just it's just one of these cool random things that happens every once in a while. Alright, we made it back to the vault. We're going to keep on moving our way past this place. And head up to the farm. Is that honey over there? Are those bees? I've never found these before. That's like one active. <laughs> Look at this. Let's take. Let's take the. Uh... Wow. Hey. Hey. Back off. Back off, dude. <laughs> I didn't think you could get honey in this game like that. That's kind of cool. Although I don't think that's how it would work in real life. <laughs> Just gotta stick my hand in this beehive. Okay, looks like we arrived at the farm. Nice. Let's see how this goes. I'm guessing it's probably not going to go very well. Anchor farm. All right, let's talk to these people. Not supposed to talk to people like you. Why not? Whoa. Is that a real pit boy? Yeah. Did you see the anchor out front? How do you think it got here? Yeah. You... You should go. All right, good talk, kid. <laughs> I guess there's an anchor out front, and that's why they call it Anchor Farm. What is this? All right, anyone else around here? Look, I'm not supposed to be talking to you, but nearest Tonka Ocean is 300 miles from here. Someone really dragged that anchor all this way? All right. What? Well, wh why is? Not he... gonna try anything, are you? There's kids here. I'm trying anything. We're just trying to make ends meet. Oh, you're not doing anything. You're just making a mess. All right, what about this person? Yo. You mind? Yo. We're minding our own business. Should try to do the same. Come on, man. I'm just passing through and stealing all your stuff. <laughs> Thought Appalachia was gonna be better. Just shut up. East. All right, let's go in here. I, I think I remember the same thing happened to me last time I played this. Like, let me feel a skill check or something. All right, let's take the dish rag. They're going to miss that. 
We'll take the sugar, the glass pitcher, the cooking pan. Oh, can't leave the ladle behind. <laughs> Pork and beans. Nice. What else do we have here? Salisbury steak, purified water, cotton candy bits, blood pack. What? What are they? <laughs> Tell me, what would you think if you went into a house that had that in the refrigerator? <laughs> All right, let's go up. Up, 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 up. All right, dude. What up? Daniel. Plenty of unclaimed space up the road. Maybe you should give it a visit. Oh, I see how it is. Heard you had some dealings with the gang up in the West Virginia lumber. West Virginia lumber? No. Don't know anything about them. Now, I'd like you to leave. Really? Really? Um, sounds like you know something. I'd love to beat it out of you, unless you want to talk. <laughs> no, 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 no. Look. We worked out a deal with them. Supplies for protection. Uh, we can work out one with you. What do you want to know? Nice. Now we're talking. The gravy is coming. The gravy train. Tell me about this deal you worked out. Once a month. Food, ammo, scrap. Murray and me take it up to the mill ourselves. Gave us a password to get in. Ah. Uh, Danube. Nice. Any idea how many people are in this gang? Plenty. A dozen, minimum. They don't let us in the main building, so I can't say how many were camped out in there. Okay, interesting. Any ideas where the guys came from? Bunch of cons from back east. They're not crazy, though. Not like the Blood Eagles or the Scorch, say. You can reason with them. Nice. They don't know how to farm or hunt. We do. So we worked out a deal. You have something you can offer them, you probably can too. Nice! So they're, uh, yeah, okay. Nah, I think I'm going to kill these guys. You can start giving those supplies to me instead. You you do that. <laughs> Maybe I can see having a little something set aside for you. One time. Though. One time? All right, dude. No other questions right now. Then by all means, beat it. Okay. Unless there's something else. Yes, yes. Um, Are you guys new to the area? Just like everyone else. Except we like our privacy. Well, you obviously don't really like your windows. <laughs> uh, are you trying to get rid of me? Trying to let you know you're trespassing. Free to leave whenever you like. Nice, nice. Thank you, thank you. What else? Uh, are you all here for the treasure? Treasure? Nothing but trouble. We'd hope to start new lives here. Private ones. So much for that. I can take a hint. And I think this is... This doesn't leave anything Fine. else. Fine. Make it quick. This is like a sub menu, like of questions I've already asked. All right, so we want to get out of there. All right, dude, good talk, man. I'll I'll be back in a bit. Awesome. So I did not run into that that conversation tree before. I think that's really cool. Uh, so I was able to intimidate him. Vegetarian zombie, the intimidator. That's right. You saw it here first. All right. <laughs> so if we look on our map here, uh, so. What we'll do in the next episode, we'll head up to the fair and uh, we'll talk with this guy who's a little crazy. And then we'll head on over to the, um, the lumber company. And I'm sure nothing bad will happen. In any case, if you have any thoughts or suggestions, uh, feel free to leave them in the comments. Or better yet, head on over to our Discord and just join us and let us know what you think. Love to, love to see you over there. All right, everyone. Thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you in the next episode. See you then.